So this boat seemed to be squatting my truck down a bit too much when I had it loaded. And so I decided to look at the tongue weight. And, you know, just to kind of guess what's going on, I looked at where the, uh, the fuel tank is. And it's uh, centered right uh, at that tape measure. And the engine is centered right at that tape measure. So, you know, they're kind of over the wheels. So they're probably not affecting the tongue weight a whole lot. And then the, uh, the trailer itself, it weighs about 2,000 pounds. And if you were to chop the trailer off right there, it would be balanced. You know, so if you chop the, chop the front of the trailer off, it would be balanced. So, you know, I was figuring, well, you know, how much does this trailer weigh in front of that tape measure? And I was like, well, maybe 400 pounds, you know. So then we split that between the weight on the, on the wheels and, and weight on the tongue. You know, approximately, we're, we're just gonna kind of rough guess this. And then for the boat, well, the boat is, uh, everything in front of that tape measure, also that weight is gonna be split approximately between the, uh, the wheels and the tongue. So I said, well, you know, let's guess that's, we got a thousand pounds of stuff, you know, seats and windows and hull, and, you know, a thousand pounds of stuff in front of that tape measure. And so that's 1,400 pounds of stuff in front of the tape measure when you add the trailer and the boat, you know, just a kind of a guess. So then to figure out, well, what's the tongue weight, then I set this contraption up on the front. So this is basically just your playground teeter-totter like you played on when you were a kid. And you remember, you know, if you didn't weigh very much, you could still pick up the fat guy if you uh, adjusted the fulcrum uh, correctly. So here we've got this bar and right here from the fulcrum, to the hitch is 16 inches and I weigh roughly 200 pounds so if I if I push down 16 inches this way and can lift it that means the tongue weight is 200 pounds but it turns out we have to uh, come all the way out to here which is 64 inches so I have four times the leverage of the boat trailer and I weigh 200 pounds so that means there's 800 pounds on the hitch and of course uh, no measurement is any good without an estimate of of the accuracy and so you figure well i'm 200 pounds and that's uh 16 inches over there so every eight inches is uh 100 pounds of error and i'm pretty sure i was balancing my weight within eight inches of that so we'll say uh 800 pounds plus or minus 50 pounds so that's about what it is. That's not too bad if I figure the uh, the weight and the weight of the trailer and the boat is you know maybe seven thousand pounds when it's full of gas and stuff. Uh, you want ten to fifteen percent of that weight on the tongue, so you know seven hundred pounds at least. So eight hundred pounds. That's that's about right. But then I was thinking, well, you know, it, it seems like it's squatting it for more than eight hundred pounds. You know, so what what might be going on here? So I decided to raise the tongue here by two inches. And if I raise the tongue by two inches, then I'm taking some weight off the front set of wheels and shifting it to the back and then putting some weight on the tongue. And so what is that worth? And well, it turns out that if I raise the tongue two inches, and I've got to come all the way out here to the end of, the, of this pipe before I can pick up the boat. So uh, that's about a 200 pound addition. So each two inches of elevation there is, is worth about 200 more pounds on your, on, on the ball on your truck, which is a lot. So the implication is it is really important to make sure that this is level, uh, particularly because this is a torsion axle suspension. If it was leaf, leaf springs with a rocker on it, then it wouldn't matter so much. But with a torsion axle, it's really important to get that flat and, uh, you know, two inches. Well, that's going to be pretty difficult to eyeball. So you probably want to get a tape measure out on a really flat surface and make sure you're level. And that's all I could think of to say on this uh, topic. So this is done.